I'm Callie O'Neill, fashion writer at Mary Claire Magazine, and today we're here with Kendra Scott, designer, CEO, and my fellow Austin, Texas native. She's known for her daring use of color, her playful twists on the classics, and her incredible commitment to giving back. Kendra, let's start with where it all began. In 2002, you started your company with just $500. Tell me why you wanted to be an entrepreneur and why jewelry? You know, I have loved fashion since I was a little girl, and I've been so blessed to have a family and parents you know, that supported me along the way. And you know, I saw that there was something missing in the jewelry industry. I was looking for attainable, beautiful, handcrafted jewelry in natural gemstones that I could afford. And that's really how Kendra Scott was born. Tell me what inspires you day to day when you're designing. I'm really inspired by the Kendra Scott customer. I mean, she is so stylish and on trend. You know, she has a pulse on what's happening in the trends and in fashion, but she has a heart that beats for her community. That's what I think of most every season as I think about that Kendra Scott girl. So Kendra, you use a lot of color in your designs and you've invented something called the color bar. Tell me about that. Color Bar is just this rainbow kaleidoscope of beautiful stones in a multitude of colors and a lot of different styles. And as the customer, you get to pick what colors you want and our stone setters in our store set them for you. Our stone setters in Austin set them for you if you're ordering online. You can literally do Color Bar online and get it on your doorstep the next day. Tell me, what, what are the pieces of jewelry that I need to own? I think every girl needs a great statement necklace um, or to be able to layer necklaces to make a statement. And you can do necklaces or have an arm party like I'm doing today or have a great statement earring. But one or two great statement pieces are so important. They can take jeans and a t-shirt to a whole nother level, um, but you could still wear it with a cocktail dress to a charity event in the evening. You know, you see a lot of successful companies, but none of them really put philanthropy so high on the list of priorities. And you really make that a hallmark of your business. And I'm curious where that came from. I lost my stepfather to cancer um, as a young woman. And you know, I really knew then that I wanted to do something more that gave back to my community in a meaningful way. And it's from every level, from a national organization to a friend in need, whatever it might be. And why is family so important to you, not just personally, but in the workplace? I've created a culture in our company that really supports family. And we treat each other like brothers and sisters. We have each other's back. We care for each other. We work as a team. It's really a united family. You went from just being a one-woman show to having your jewelry carried in 38 standalone stores around the U.S. and 500 retailers. We're actually going to have 39 stores by January, which is really exciting. Amazing. <laughs> what are your secrets to success? You've got to have passion. Yeah. Um, and you have to know that it's a journey and that the struggles will make you stronger. Do what you love. Surround yourself with people that believe in you, even when you don't believe in yourself and never ever give up.